Okay, I'm finally making this video. It's the Cosmic Clan video. Some of my subscribers actually want help with it, and I'm just gonna help them out. So, you don't need any of these launchers. You launch, you can literally just get rid of these launchers. You don't need them. Here's the launcher here for Cosmic Client. You download it. By the way, the download link will be in the description. So just click it and it'll bring you to the download page and just click download. I'm not gonna show you how to download it because it's pretty straightforward. Click download and then it downloads. Okay, I don't know why I'm opening Cosmic Client again. I already have it open. Um, okay. Well, I'll just close this one then. So when it opens, this is what it looks like. I'll go to game capture now so you guys can see the full game. Go full screen here. There you go. When you go full screen, some of these things pop up. Nothing really matters on this page except for you need to add an account. In order to play Minecraft on this Cosmic Client, you need to go to accounts, add account, then put your stuff in. You cannot sign up your account here using an email. I mean, using your username. You need to use an email. You can't use your username. It won't work. Password. It's pretty straightforward. Back and you can go on any server you want. Let's go on Treasure Wars. In the hub, just kind of sit there and I'll show you the mods. Okay, what's happening here? So, here's the mod. When you click right shift on a keyboard, it opens the menu like this. As you can see, it opens the menu. Here is accounts. You can have other accounts on. Here's the waypoints. Set waypoints. I'm just get rid of that because I'm gonna show you something later. Settings. This is how you move the mods. By the way, you go to settings. Click the HUD. You can move it wherever you want. You can put it right in the middle of your screen. You can put it on the right side of your screen. Doesn't really matter. Click escape to go backwards. Profiles. This doesn't really like do anything besides like have different account mods. So say if you wanted to go rating, you just click on a, on a profile and it'll set your mods to a rating like area. And then that's pretty much it. Here are the mods. Um, the main mods you really need and people want are. The information HUD, which is this, keystrokes mod, which is the CPS, crosshair mod, which is the thing in the middle of my screen, armor HUD, potion, um, toggle sprint, world downloader, you don't need, I'm gonna get rid of that because I don't need it, um, I'm not downloading any worlds, scoreboard is this thing, and then the screenshot uploader, which is really helpful, main mods you need, and those are the mods I'm gonna go through in this video. Okay, so let's start with the toggle sprint, you can go to settings, you can go to mechanics, and it's right there. You click on it, you can turn it off, you can turn it on, and this fly boosting thing, when you fly, like, see if you're flying in creative mode, you can pretty much go faster and slower. Um, let me quickly get on a creative world and I'll show you. Show you it, so see how I'm flying up and down really fast, see this? I'm going up and down really, really fast, yeah. So that's what this thing is. I, I could put the freaking 8, watch how fast I go up and down, see? It's, I'm not sure if it's bannable. Let's see if you have slash fly on a server. I'm not sure if it's bannable, but use it at your own risk. I don't use it because I don't have any fly things on any servers besides Hypixel because I have a rank there. Oh, so it's back down to two. Okay, that's good enough. So there's a toggle sprint. You go back here. Toggle sneak. You can use it. I don't use it. I just don't really need toggle sneak. Tools. This is all like for cannons and building bases. Chunk borders, you can turn this off, and it's like, just shows you the chunks, like, say if I go down to the ground here. Here's all, here are all the chunks, so, it'll help you, um, like, get claims easier, I think. Um, so let's turn it off, I don't need that. Let's go to the HUD, keystrokes mod, if you want the CPS, and the, see as you can see CPS, you can turn it off and on with this arrow. Or you can turn it all this on, and you can, like, see my keystrokes, and stuff like that, so let me... I can make it as big as I want. I can move it, see in the middle of my screen, just have it right there. Um, I don't want it right there because that's kind of um, not good. So you can click escape to go back. You can just get rid of this, put it back down to whatever size you had it at. I'm gonna put it down, I'm gonna put it to like one. All right, yeah, that's good enough right there. Okay, and then here's the color. The color doesn't really matter, and you can put red, it just matters what you like. Um, armor HUD, here it is. Armor HUD's right here on the bottom right of my screen. You can uh, turn the hand item on to so see if I'm like, um, see if I'm holding grass. It'll see I'm holding grass. Then bottom right. Um, let's go back to it. Where to go? Uh, armor HUD. You can have show items name. So grass block, as you can see, 
I'll see if I had diamond armor on. Um, let's go to armor real fast. Um, let's get like a thing. See, it says I have a chain chest blade on and holding a grass block. I don't really turn any of that stuff on because I don't really need it. So I kind of just have the armors like that. Show label. Don't really need that. You can have any font you want. This is the cool part. So, um, say, okay. I'll do better at demonstration. Let's, uh, let's go to the info. Information HUD. See it here? Okay, sorry about that. Um, so let's go to the information HUD. I'll do better demonstration of this. As you can see, here it is. You can make it humongous. You can make it really small. I have it to like one usually. Um, line height. That's just like if you want it packed in smaller or bigger. Prefix. That's just like that stuff. I like that. You can have it bold. You can have it bold. You can have it underlined. All you got all this cool stuff. But let's go for, to the main things. I want to show you. Um, let's turn all this off. So if you scroll down, here it is. Say, I want to call it um like the uh, oh crap hang on i just closed out of there um see it says like the and see like the video there so as you can see in top right it says like the video you can change it to anything you want it's really helpful especially if you want to make videos you know remind them to like the video um here it is um these things display fps clicks per second then they have it all on your screen, like right here. Like, I mean, if it's helpful to have all these mods on your screen, then go for it. You can have every mod that you want. Like, you can have literally every mod that you want. I um, don't want these mods on my screen. So I'm going to get rid of them and just have these. Um, Wait, where my cords go? <laughs> I want kind of the cords mod. I don't want that. Um, here it is. There, chords mod. There you go. As you can see, CPS and chords mod. It's really helpful. And yeah, okay. Now let's go into the um. Let's go into toggles. We already did that. Crosshair mod. That's a big one. As you can see, my crosshair in the middle of my screen. If you want it that smooth and clean, then go to the crosshair mod, not keystrokes. Go to the crosshair mod. Here it is. You can turn it on dynamics when you punch stuff. It like bounces. Um. Now I gotta go back. Hang on a second. Back it up. There we go. I don't want dynamic. This is just like how much the dynamic thing bounces. You can have it really big, really skinny. You can have it humongous. You can have it small. I have mine at like, like this usually, I like five. All right, whatever. It's good enough right there. Okay. Gap. This is how the bigger the gap is. I have it at two point because I don't like having a big gap. When I'm maybe ping with the crosshair mod. The dot. Here's a dot. People have been asking where the dot is. The dot's right under the gap thing. You can have it like humongously like this. <laughs> Looks kind of weird. I don't really like that, so I'm gonna turn it off and just put this back down. To that and that's pretty much the mod, you guys. So if you don't want any other questions, then just post in the comments some questions. I can help you out. I'm pretty familiar with this mod now. I've been using it for like a day, but I've been getting used to the mods. So I'm not a big noob about this, but I'm still not the smartest about these mods. I'm still learning, just like other people are learning. And yeah, if you guys, make sure you guys like the video, subscribe if you're new, and yeah, bye.